Hey guys, this is Aaron with Zolo Tech. Today I have a something a little bit unusual. This is from Budget Gadgets again. Uh, this is a stylus for your iPhone or iPod Touch. Now, maybe you like that idea, maybe you don't. Um, myself, I don't mind using my finger. But what makes these interesting is the reason you don't ha already have a stylus is the way this screen works. It's conductive. Um, you know, it's not just, it, you can't just touch it with your nail and expect it to work. There's not like two layers if you if you look up how they work. Uh, these stylus or styli are a couple dollars. So we'll just open it. That's all you get. These two things here. Now, the end is a little bit weird on these. I tried this out before the video. This wasn't sealed or anything, so this is like a rubbery feel. So let's turn it on and see how well it works. So, initial impressions. Now, I just cleaned the screen, too. So, I don't know if you see, well, you see a glare. Let me, let me, uh, there we go. Let's see. So, well, it works. You can see that. Now, uh, you have to, it's got a rubbery feel to it, so you have to give it a little bit of force. See him pushing there? <laughs> I just moved everything around. So, it does work, but you have to give it a little bit of force. Now, with a screen protector on, we'll try it later too, once I, I don't have a screen protector on this right now, but with a screen protector on it, this may be easier to slide, but right now, there's a, a fair amount of resistance here. So, if I hit, um, you know, stocks here, it works. Pushing a button is not a problem. The problem comes with scrolling. See, I'm just... This, I'm not putting any pressure. See? Doesn't work that way. Put a little bit of pressure. You can see the tip bend. It works. Now, for someone that wants a stylus, must have a stylus. I know somebody that doesn't like to touch their, you know, device because they don't want to wipe off the smudges or see the smudges all the time. To me, that's not a big enough deal to use a stylus. I prefer just to use my finger. It works fine. Um, for, let's see. Wikipedia. So, again, I had, see, I had to push that twice. I'm not a big fan of these. But I thought it would be something interesting to check out. Uh, let's see. So, if we hit here. Okay, so the keyboard comes up. Well. Let's see if we can... We'll type Zolo Tech. Uh, works pretty good for the type. Uh, I, I'm still faster that way, but uh, you know, if you want to select, works pretty good with that. It looks like the majority of your issue is going to be with scrolling. So, you know, for a couple dollars, and you need one, or you prefer this sort of sort of, uh, you know, you need a stylus for your iPhone, iPod Touch. Definitely, you know, they do work. Uh, they may work a little bit better with a screen protector on, but I figured we'd try it on the glass to see how that goes. See, now if I want to scroll fast, well, it looks like it's working. I don't know if it's picky or what. Um, see the calculator. Maybe it, it seems like it's working easier now that I've used it a little bit. That's a little mm -hmm. strange. I'm not really... Let's see if I don't put any pressure. So no pressure at all works. Maybe I've just gotten used to it. Little pressure exerted works. More pressure than you would expect, I think. Um, not as easy as like a, a pen point stylus. But, uh, you know, it, definitely an interesting idea. I know someone that's going to love this, and you may too. But for me, I'm just not going to use it. Uh, but, you know, again, I'll try it out again and just let you know if, in a, a quick follow-up, let you know if it works better on a screen protector or not. Uh, it works okay if you're just going to use it like a pencil, but again, you're not going to get pinpoint accurate, accuracy with it. So, But again, thank you very much, Budget Gadgets, for sending this. Um, and this is the stylus for, uh, you know, for iPhone, iPod Touch. BudgetGadgets.com. Uh, they're like $2 with free shipping. So definitely, definitely check them out if you're interested. They have a lot of other cool things there too, really. Uh, a lot of good cases, a lot of cheap cases if you need, you know, something like that. Tripods even. Uh, so again, this is Aaron with Zolotech. We'll see you next time.